Nowadays, there are huge volumes of products containing lithium-ion batteries circulating in the society. Cars, mobile phones, electric bikes, screwdrivers and many other products we use in our daily lives. The research project Recycling of Metals from Spent Lithium-Ion Batteries is funded by the Swedish Battery Fund. The purpose of the project is to generate fundamental knowledge for resource-efficient thermal recycling methods for today's and tomorrow's lithium-ion batteries. The two methods that has been tested is that you could recycle the lithium-ion batteries through an alumina smelter. The conclusion from that is to a certain extent you can add the lithium-ion batteries to the alumina melt. And the other process route is through a typical copper smelting route where we have tested to, uh, to recycle the batteries to recover copper and cobalt and also uh, in parallel to that also extract lithium through for example a gas phase where it then ends up in a dust which could be treated further on. This is an enabler for us to be able to put electromobility on the, on the road in those amounts that we are looking for in 2025. Bolo Cars is looking for to put on the market one million electrified cars by 2025. And of course, we have to look at the whole sustainability spectra. The production of lithium-ion batteries contributes substantially to the total impact of electric vehicle production. This particular product is looking into one of the very important ingredients in the car batteries. And the current technology that the, the automotive industry is using right now is the lithium-ion based uh, technology. And that is, uh, as long as we see right now, the, the one that is taking us forward. So what we know today is that we can prolong the life, but of course one day uh, it will, the life will end. And then we need to have a, a very efficient recycling pro process for this. There are changes. Lithium is available in limited quantities in the world and the battery material content is changing. This type of collaboration is uh, very important for building since we already have a very strong collaboration with Stena. We get a lot of our recycled material from there. And it's important to have a holistic view. In this type of collaborations we have the collectors, we have the scientific part of it, we have the, uh, the producers such as Volvo etc. It's very important to get the whole picture. Uh, my opinion is that the two get a sustainable recycling option. You need to have a certain combination of different methods to be able to extract more metals. Very important is what we can call design for recycling that you already in the construction part think about that this is something that should be recycled and today we have a complete recovery of, of lead from lead batteries and I think that will come with the lithium-ion batteries also in the future.